Remember those days when you could sleep with your makeup on? Remember? You wouldn't even take your mascara off. <laughs> I don't either. Check out my nighttime ritual. Let's keep it real. In our 20s, we barely took our lipstick off after a night of partying. We will go to sleep like this. And if we had work the next day, we may even just keep this on. You know, para no pasar el trabajo. Why go through the trouble of putting your makeup back on? But then, in your 30s, someone tells you that you need three products. You need a cleanser, you need a toner and a moisturizer. Cause nena, you're not gonna be young forever. Around your late thirties, someone says, hmm, it's not looking that tight under your eyes. And you add eye cream. Prepare yourself for your forties. Going to bed is a half hour project. Check it out. First, you have to take your eye makeup off because God forbid you go to bed with your mascara and your eyeliner and all that stuff. All right. Then after that, you go to the cleanser that also has a scrub. And honestly, I'm not promoting any brands here. Just so you know, I just want to show you how long this process is. Once you put this on, you gotta wait two minutes so the scrubbing is effective. for when your dermatologist says everything has to say anti-aging. You start with a toner. Hi! You make sure that it dries. Then the serum, vitamin C. Mm-hmm. Put the serum on. But you just don't do this. Let me show you how you roll it in. I have a friend who keeps this in the refrigerator because when you're in your 40s, you have to roll the product in. Roll it in. Planchalo, planchalo, okay? So the serum, so the serum works. You're done with the serum, los ojos. You gotta do the eyes, girl, the eyes. And if no one told you, you're gonna need a nighttime cream for your face. Don't care, you do this. Uh huh. Right. And after that, don't forget to floss. That thing of I floss two days before the dentist, that doesn't work anymore. You better floss or you'll die of gingivitis. <laughs> then you're saying, oh my God, I can see the bed. It's time to go to sleep, I'm almost done. Girl, you're not, you got more stuff to do at your night table. Remember when you were single, you didn't have any kids and you were in your 20s and 30s, your night table was nice and empty, <laughs> not anymore. I need everything you see right there so I can guarantee a good night's sleep. When you were younger, you would put some lotion on your hands. Ladies, get ready for your 40s, mid 40s. You're gonna need a thick lotion and you're going to have to put it on your hands and your feet. Mm-hmm. This is not a smooth in between pedicures, trust me. Then, after that, you're gonna need something different from the lips. 
because these chap and overnight all these lotions work better so you ah the good thing about this product is that it's nice for your cuticles because this one's also dry up. In the words of my amazing mother, todo se seca, everything dries up. Oh, by the way, watch my amazing mother and more words of wisdom in this video of an interview I did with her a long time ago. If you've had babies, you know that you have aches and pains that you didn't have before. So some days my right wrist is not feeling great because I overextended it while picking up my son. So I put this on for a little bit and it just steadies everything. Do you think it's time now? No, my dear friends, not yet. No Mimi time yet. 30 minutes before bedtime, if you wanna sleep after the age of 40, your doctor may tell you you need melatonin. So you take one of these 30 minutes before bedtime. And if you take your pills at night, you maybe have purchased this already, get over it, get over it. You need one of these daily things because you're gonna have to take, let me show you. You're gonna have to take a biotin palpelo for the hair, your anti-anxiety pill, because now you're a mom, you have a mortgage, you have a husband and a job. Echinacea, because who can get sick? Vitamin D to fend off the COVID and because there's not enough sunlight where I live during six months of the year. And the multivitamin, but this multivitamin is for women, you know, grown up women. So get water. and take your pills. We're almost ready, but one more thing. And you let me know, I wanna know, how many pillows do you use to sleep? And have they increased with your age? Leave me your comment right there. Leave me a message. Subscribe if you'd like. Let's keep it real together. I started sleeping when I was young and unafraid with two pillows. Look at how many I need now. One, two, three and they have to be in that situation you see how you see these two for the acid reflux right and then because i had babies who i love i need these two my bones because i have to do this this is how i sleep ahora sí sweet dreams